Welcome again to our short midday reflection. It's a bit chilly outside today, so I thought I'd move indoors for this one. In the fourth of these reflections on Be With Us, Good Lord, we come to the word good. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I often find myself saying at baptisms and other services where people may not be used to churchy language, that God is goodness and love. I do that because I believe that most people identify with goodness and love, or at least recognise what they look like. So in this way, everyone can recognise God. Sometimes we in churches fall into the trap of thinking that we have the monopoly over what is good. But right now we are reminded that this is really not the case. Let us wake up and recognise acts of goodness and love all around us, springing up all over the place in the way that people are supporting each other in these difficult times. The goodness of others gives us a window into what God is like. Jesus said, I am the good shepherd. And so we look to Christ to shepherd the whole world, to steer and nurture us all in all goodness, in the way we live with each other, in the way we live with the gift of our environment. A short time of stillness, some music and a prayer. The King of love my shepherd is, whose goodness faileth never. Let us pray. Be with us, good Lord, in all that we do today, in the people we will meet and in the things that we will say. Still our hearts with your presence. May we find new ways to show goodness to our world. Be with us, good Lord. We say together the words of the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, 
for ever and ever. Amen. And the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be with each of you and those you pray for this day and always. Amen. Bye for now.